All right, now that we're at the desktop, we want to activate the NVIDIA control panel by right-clicking the desktop and selecting uh, control panel from the drop-down menu. And here we are. We have the control panel. On the left side under 3D settings, um, you'll have an option to configure SLI, physics, and surround. And that's the one you want to choose. Uh, we're on that menu now. and Within these options, you'll have the choice to span displays with surround. And we'll go ahead and choose that. You'll notice that the control panel um, displays all three of your monitors and actually which connector they're using. Go ahead and click configure and you'll get this prompt to show you how to connect um, your DVI cables to your um, connectors on your video card. And it'll give you a list um, telling you whether or not they work. And click apply. Um, you're going to see the screens blank out for a few seconds. Uh, we have a prompt here for uh, configuring displays. So with this menu, you can actually move displays around. Um, you can see here, notice that our monitors aren't correct. And once you do get them in the right order, click apply. This gives you the option for bezel correcting. Um, let's do that. Let's choose yes. And it wants you, it asks you to adjust the width until the lines on the preview image appear continuous. And that preview image is right here. So you can either press up or down um, t on these arrows to change the width, or you can just enter it in. Um, that's about right for our setup. What you need to do, you need to do it for both sides of this, the middle monitor. So you see we did left side now we have to do the right side and um, I just went ahead and, and put in the same number depending on your setup um, they might be a little bit different so that's that's useful and once we've done that we click on create resolutions and you'll notice the screen blank out and come back in. And that's it. Now we've got our NVIDIA surround monitor set up, configured with bezel correction.